Hi there! In this video we will see an overview and how to set up job posting groups within Financials for Office 365. One aspect of planning jobs is deciding which posting accounts to use for job costing. A posting group represents a link between the job and how it should be treated in the general ledger. When you create a job you specify a posting group and by default each task you create for the job is associated with that posting group. Let's hop into a job card to see where the job posting group field is kept. Search jobs in the universal search box or use your role center or navigation pane where relevant. The field is found in the posting fast tab like so. Let's open the job posting groups page. Here we can view the GL accounts associated with the posting group. For each posting group you set up, you must create links to the relevant GL accounts. You can use the same GL accounts for different account numbers for each posting group. After you've set up the job posting groups, you can assign them to the relevant jobs. When you post to a job, the program will post to the GL that is specified by the job posting group linked to the job. However, as you create tasks, you can override the default and select a posting group that is more appropriate. Now I can take you through each one of the posting fields within the job posting group. Next we have the WIP costs account. This is the WIP account for calculated cost of the job WIP, which is a balance sheet capital asset account. The occurred cost accounts is an account for the cost value or cost of sales method of WIP calculation, which is a balance sheet occurred expense liability account. This will be posted to when the WIP adjustment requires the usage costs posted to the income statement to be increased. The applied account is a balancing account to the WIP costs account, which is a contra for a negative expense account. This is the same for the items cost account that also acts as a contra for WIP costs, and the same for resource cost applied account. GL costs applied account acts in the same way too, as a contra for a negative expense account. And lastly, the job costs adjustment account to the WIP accrued costs account, which is an expense account. If you want to find out specifically, just click on the caption of the column and you can see the definition like so. Let's make a new one for this example. Naturally, posting groups don't need to be with different posting accounts. It could just be so you could group your jobs like so. Each one of these has a specific purpose and posting method. Now, if you have any questions while using financials for Office 365, you can click on the question mark for a Windows specific help page. If you want help with a field, click on the caption or a column, click on the heading and select help like so. It's that easy. And that's how you set up job posting groups.